we must make sure that this Africa is linked together. We must violently demolish the borders that exist between our countries because those are not our borders. You cannot worship a border between Tanzania and Kenya and come and sit in this wall and say you are a pan-Africanist. A pan-Africanist means the first task is to get rid of colonial borders so that we bring Africa together in practical terms. I don't know if President William Ruto means it because he said so many things and I can't locate him these days because the things he said during election and the things he's doing now are two different things. I don't know. Because I heard him saying we need to do away with the dollar and build our own currency but his actions are not speaking to anything of doing away with the dollar. The latest being putting a red carpet for a murderer, a person who killed the Kenyan people coming into this country, receiving a red carpet and being saluted by our own army. This is not a Kenyan army, it's not a colonialist army. The Kenyan army is a product of the Mau Mau rebellion. And those who killed our people in the Mau Mau rebellion cannot be saluted by the same army of the children of those who were killed during Mau Mau rebellion. We have a duty to stay true to the cause. We have a duty to remind the king and Britain of what they did to us. Indeed, he shows no remorse. He says this was bad, it shouldn't have happened. But he runs short of, I apologize. I am sorry. He will never say he is sorry for because he thinks that his race makes him superior and he's not qualified to apologize to those who are junior to him. We call upon the, the Kenyan government to be firm and to decide what they want to be. Do they want to be Pan-Africanist or do they want to be proponents of neocolonialism? You can't have it both. Only one call must be made and that call is of Pan-Africanism. We all know who Julius Malema is. That most times is so complex a man to understand. But in this video, where he actually calls Omodra, what do you think? Yes, you must welcome to the Searchers Blood family today. I want to say thank you to all that have been liking, commenting, sharing our videos. We uh, really appreciate you. Don't stop. Yes, I remain Jaquette Oluwani Setro, and I always have with me my friend Yotsb. This is Arsenal, the most handsome, yakable African. It's just only pumping a piece of my own husband. And as usual, I always have my Silicon Valley hot baby girl here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what do you think in this video that we just watched today with all the said and done of Julius Malema? I want to seriously warn uh, Malema. You do not have that constituency right to speak about my client like that. Why will you be calling a whole king? King Charlie. King Charlie, a murderer. That is totally, is it reproachful? I think it was almost. Anyway, I take an objection to that. Did you see him kill any African person? <coughs> mm. <coughs> okay, but what I can deduce from this is that another thing you were saying, you were trying to say that the president of Kenya is playing Muluku Malankwa. <laughs> they are still your people. <laughs> No, I don't know President. William Roto. William Roto was The it? other day he said, we are going to take away uh, the uh, dollar currency. We are going to get our own currency. And the other day, the next time you are seeing him spread the red carpet for what I don't want to say. It is Julius Malama that has the capacity. To anyway, what I will say about um, uh, William Roto is that, you know, in Africa, we name each children the way and manner we want them to behave. So since his name is William Roto, in Nigeria, Roto Roto is, is, is a charisma of 
neither be here or there. <laughs> so it depends on the Victoria Road to see. So, and roto means something that is rotating. So it can rotate to this side this morning and rotate to another part next time. All the same, you know, we are not going to be blaming him because one of the laws in diplomacy is that even if you have grievance with any uh, of the Western allies, any any country, you still have to be diplomatic about it. Courtesy demands that you still roll the blood carpet, sorry, the red carpet for the the king of uh, this. After all, the 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 red that you even say in Africa it means something, it means ninja. <laughs> uh, so so is not is, there is nothing he could do about that. There is no way the prince will be coming to Kenya and the uh, roto, oh, sorry, the uh, rotator, uh, what's his name? <laughs> and uh, roto, roto rondos. Uh, so, sorry. <laughs> roto rondos, Gagalonje. <laughs> roto roto, William Roto Roto will not. <laughs> Because, uh, I think yeah. I have to <laughs> So, I think we have to end this. Uh, but uh, Julius Malema has actually said it all. So, if you really want to say you, it's better you hear from the Aussies, but I don't want to be the one repeating. Are you me. calling him an Aus? Uh, yeah, anyone you want to say. Because anyway, see. The thing is, mm -hmm. uh, William Roto, are you pan African or you are against the pan Africanism movement? How can a president be pan anything? Any African president is not pan anything. Any African president, they are president. P start for president. And what letter start for puppet? <laughs> I don't know why she's laughing, no, but I, I don't think I've said anything wrong. Yet. It's, it's only a coincidence that P stand for puppet and P start for president. So maybe we should just stick to the limelight of not uh, looking for uh, for not looking for pencil in an acid box. So I think it's better we just stick our eyes to the game plan because uh, the president have to be cautious to whoever is coming into the country because of diplomatic reason. And that's why he has hey, to be in a roto roto way. Hey, but uh, the words, what you say should actually go with your actions, not just the president now, but every other thing, as in what Julius Malema an exception to said, that. I think the borders from the African countries, borders that were created by this. He so said that when he woke up on a particular side of the bed, and I'm sure the side of the bed I woke up this time and was not the same side of the bed. So if you talk about the road to But they, they, he has already said that they are going to remove the borders. They are making a uh, uh, what's it called Kenya visa free from the end of this year. You know what I like about Roto? Is that he is not a man that does his action now. He always say it about the future. You know, his mate Kigami removed it instantly. But Roto Roto, he said what? He said he will do. I will do now, promise. <laughs> On this note, please, you have to. No, 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 no. I'm just firing up now. I go, I go. Do. I That's future, <laughs> futuristic. And anything that is futuristic, especially when it's coming from the mouth of politicians anywhere in the world, they are all the same. When they say, I go or I will or I, I swear to God, truth, truth be said, when they say that, just know that. Mm, <laughs> because it's they, might, they, might, they might end up not mm. doing it. So let us wait till next year. If the border of uh, uh, which Kenya, why is Zimbabwe coming? To <laughs> because Zimbabwe might actually open their border before Kenya. <laughs> <laughs> so especially with all these different different people coming to visit the other time, was it not Kamala Yala Malaharis? <laughs> and the other time it was Yala Malaharis. You know Yala Malaharis, not Kamala Harris that came to Kenya. I think it's Kenya that she came to, and I'm sure she would have served them some hot amala. Is that time the whole of Africa began to watch Kenya closely to really know what they are bringing? The come the rumor shop, <laughs> <laughs> because they, they a lot of a lot of Western powers seem to have interest in that country, and um, I think. And when you see a place like that, that is Ogbole, 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 Ogbole. 
Ogba or le Ogboli. My wife doesn't understand you, but <laughs> shut up. When you see a place like that, if a man face in it, my wife doesn't. Just if a man is a good Muslim, shut up. When when she's just <laughs> shut up on national TV. And in it case, it because it I know that some of you will see this video <laughs> and you will say, why will, they, why will your wife tell you shut up? It's our romantic love. <laughs> so please face your own marital. But I know that if we look at your house now, maybe you just use this spoon to eat your husband and nobody will hear about that. But if my wife says shut up, say, say, say shut up. No, say it. It's been long to say it. Say it again. Oh, so romantic. <laughs> So we have been said, I think we have some other things to do in the Inza, Inza or that room. <laughs> so I'm not using road to road to I beg, please watch it when you're talking to me. So that, because the internet doesn't, the internet doesn't forgive. When you say A in the morning and it's uh, in the afternoon and you're saying B, they will say, Oh, she be road to road. Oh, I'm so koto koto. Yes. Okay, that's it. On this note, we like to put this uh, vlog or video to an end. Uh, but before we end, don't forget, we bring smiles and joy from Africa. That's the Cetris family. Whatever be the news we are trying to hear, we just make it look funny and make you have some element of joy in it because joy is your strength and your strength, it's your life. And that joy is so scarce in the world now. But I want to tell you, the joy is from the Holy Spirit. So look within, allow God in you. Don't look at what is happening around because if you look at what is happening around, that person might just die of that attack. Yes. Let me tell you, that has been our secret in Nigeria especially. Majority of the countries of the world cannot survive what is going on here, but most of the time we turn it into comedy. We play over it because ah, they want to kill ourselves. <laughs> so we, we, we just bring joy out of every situation because when you are still alive, that's still hope. Yes. And in the, light, in the light of this, we want to tell you about little projects that we are doing this December 9th because of the problem that the challenges that people are facing in this country, uh, food stuff, scarcity, and all the likes. I hike in prices and all the likes, and a lot of people are going through yeah. hunger problem. So we decided to try to feed about 1,000 plus persons that might not be financially able to take care of their needs. So, uh, so that will be done on the streets of Lagos yeah. and on the 9th of December 2023. In Lagos. So, yes, in Lagos. So if you're anywhere in Lagos, you can just decide to join us. You reach out to us on our numbers showing below. The contribution for this has started. And I want to say thank you to all that have been reaching out to us in all our past events. We say we, we do share live chickens at Christmas to the less privileged. And we pick up indigent youth, but diligent ones from the streets. We enroll them in various crafts and we empower them. We give them a space for their work. That's what we've been doing with the help of wonderful people from this platform. We are not taking you for granted. God bless you and you don't lose your reward. So just with a dollar, you can help feed someone with a meal. So you can use our GoFundMe link or PayPal account that will be displayed below or whichever means you choose out of what will be displayed. Please, as you do this, God will help you. Remember, the person you're helping today might actually be the one to save your life or your family member's life tomorrow. So thank you so very much. Till we come your way in the next video, don't forget to keep your joy and your joy therapy. And always do the joy therapy syndrome that I always pronounce at the end of every video. If you have a wife beside you, hug her so tight that everyone will know that an angel is being hugged on head. And in case you do, you are not married, please look for the next transformer. <laughs> oh, la, la. <laughs> okay, till we, till we come away in the next video. Catch you, love you, bye bye.